Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Coupon Wins with Lens. We're headed into Walgreens this week to see what deals we can find. I went ahead and placed an online order last night for pickup because those Revlon I bought a rebates are gonna expire in a couple of days and I wanted to get in on it because last time I totally missed it. So let's go pick up our order and get into these deals. First things first, I did a pickup order for some Revlon products. I grabbed one Lustrous Lip Gloss and one Revlon So Fierce Mascara. They're on sale this week for buy one, get one 50% off. And we got an $8 digital. So you can see on the screen what my total is. These products are a little bit cheaper online. That's why I placed the order for pickup. And it worked out great because my total was $12.13. I used that $8 digital. And after sales tax, my total was literally $5.01. So I rolled $5 in Walgreens cash, paid one penny out of my pocket. The total before tax was just $4.13. And then I got back a $4 register reward for purchasing two of them. And I redeemed on Ibotta for $6 back, $3 for the eye product, and $3 for the lip product, making my final cost for all of these things a $5.87 money maker. Run on these Revlon deals because they are going fast. Just make sure to grab one eye product and one lip product, or one face product and one eye product, and see what Ibotta rates you have to make this work. Let's get into our second transaction. The first thing I'm grabbing is these big pens. They're on sale this week for buy one, get one 50% off. And we have a three off two digital. So two of them are gonna total me $3.73. I'll use that $3 digital. I'll pay 73 cents for these at checkout. However, I'm pairing these into a spend deal. So let's put this deal together. Check your Walgreens clearance. There's lots of items up to 90% off. My store was kind of out of stock on things I wanted to grab, but you may find some better things at your store. I really wanted to avoid getting toothpaste this week. I was just tired of getting it. And I haven't gotten razors from Walgreens in a while. So I'm going to do this razor deal. Gillette and Venus are on sale for spend 20, get a $10 cash reward. So I'm picking up one Gillette razor for $10.99 and one Gillette razor for $9.99. This is going to total me $20.98. I have a $3 digital on Gillette and a $3 paper coupon on Gillette. So I'll be left to pay $14.98 and I'll get back $10. But again, I'm pairing this into a spend deal to make this even sweeter. The next thing I'm grabbing is some candy that has an Ibotta rebate that I'm also able to use register rewards on. So I'm grabbing these turtles. They're priced at two for three. So I'll pay $3 at checkout, but then Ibotta's giving me back $1.69 for buying two, making them just 65 cents each, and they're super delicious. As we get closer to the school year, we're gonna see super good deals like these 49 cent razors. I have a lot of register rewards I'm gonna to roll today because I did that Oral-B deal a couple weeks ago, the glitch that was giving back two register rewards. So I'm gonna roll those because they're gonna expire. So I'm grabbing two of these cap erasers for 49 cents. And I'm gonna show you exactly how my coupon should attach. So I'm spending over $25 so I can use this paper booster for spend 25, get $7 in Walgreens cash rewards. I also have a spend 12, get $3 cash rewards digital on my account. So I'll get back a total of $10 in cash rewards from that. I have a $3 paper coupon for the other Gillette, the $3 digital for the BIC. I have four register rewards I'm gonna roll. I have a $3 one, a $6 one from a couple weeks ago. I have two $5 ones I'm gonna roll. So all of these are gonna attach to items that don't have coupons like the turtles and the cap erasers. When I have lots of register rewards like this, I use them on spend deals so that I can lower my out of pocket and turn these register rewards into Walgreens cash. So you can see I'm spending quite a bit in register rewards. To be exact, I'm spending right at $19 just in register rewards, but I'm expected over $20 back in Walgreens cash between the paper booster, the digital booster, and the spend deal on the Gillette razors. So that's how I plan to do this because I want to roll those register rewards into Walgreens cash and keep that money rolling back and forth. 
I'm also burning these two store coupons that came from the Oral-B glitch a couple weeks ago where you were getting back a manufacturer register reward and a store coupon register reward. The vitamin waters are on sale for three for three this week and the Perrier drinks are on sale two for two. So I'm grabbing a couple of these and burning these $5 register rewards. They're actually store coupons. I'm gonna have to do two transactions because you can only use one store coupon per transaction and these are expiring this week, so I need to go ahead and spend them. I'm on my way to check out, and I saw this People magazine with Britney on it. Guys, how do you guys feel about the Britney thing? Do we need a free Britney? I think we do. Let me know in the comments how you stand on the free Britney movement. Here we are home from Walgreens. This is everything we were able to pick up today. My goal today was to not get toothpaste, y'all. I just didn't want to get toothpaste from Walgreens. I get toothpaste from Walgreens every week just to make my other deals better. But this week I said, no, thank you. If I would have got toothpaste, yes, this could have been even better, but we did pretty great making this a money maker without buying toothpaste. So let's go over our transactions. I will show you exactly what I did for pickup, the receipts, as well as my second receipt for all of these items that you see here. Here are my pickup items. I got the Revlon So Fierce Mascara, as well as the Super Lustrous Gloss. This actually looks really pretty. I'm super excited about that. After coupons, this just totaled me $4.13. I did get back a $4 register reward, it's in the car. And I got back that $6 on Ibotta, making this like a huge money maker. So that's super exciting. Let's look at the receipt. I already showed you this in store, but here's the receipt again. I paid $4.13 plus tax, got back that $4 register reward and $5 and $6 on Ibotta, making this almost a $6 money maker, which is amazing and also helped us out on this transaction. Even though this transaction turned out to be a money maker by itself, having a money maker pickup transaction always sweetens the deal. So here we go with this deal. We had the $3 coupons on the Gillette. One was digital, one was paper. One of them did not come off, but Walgreens customer service did issue me the $3 for the other one. So we'll look at that in just a second. I got the cap erasers because they're a good thing for back to school and I needed something for register rewards to attach to. I got the turtles because there's an Ibotta rebate and I could also use register rewards to attach to them. And I was rolling four register rewards that were gonna expire this week so that I could turn them into Walgreens cash and this worked out perfect. And then we had the two pins that were buy one get one 50% off. They totaled me $3.73. Use that $3 coupon, paid 73 cents plus tax. And there's new colors included, which I don't know which one of these is new because I a few packs of these because I like them and these all look the same. Anyways, let's look at the receipt for this. Here's the Bic, buy one get one 50% off at the top. The Turtles, two for three. The Eraser Caps, 49 cents each. As well as the Gillette Fusion and the Gillette Pro Glide. One was $9.99 and one was $10.99. I needed to spend $20 so that I could get back $10 on Walgreens cash. At the bottom, you can see I used that paper booster. The Gillette paper coupon came off, the Gillette digital did not. I used a $3 digital for the big pins. I rolled $18 in register rewards because they were gonna expire and I needed to spend them and turn them into Walgreens cash. My total at the bottom is $3.69. It should have been 69 cents because of the digital for the Gillette not coming off. If you didn't have any register rewards to roll, your total would be $19.69 because I used $19 in register reward and your $3 digital would come off in that situation because you're not using register rewards. So for me, it should have been 69 cents because I used $19 in register rewards and my digital should have come off. But for you, if you had zero register rewards to roll, your total would be $19.69. But I did get back $20.28 in Walgreens cash. $10 for the Gillette Pro Glide, $7 for that paper booster, and $3 for my digital booster. I also got back $1.69 on Ibotta for the turtles, making this transaction right here a $2.28 moneymaker. Sorry, my stuff kind of fell. So $2.28 moneymaker for this one, a $5.87 moneymaker for this one. So grand total for today was an $8 moneymaker for everything you see here. Yes. Ma'am, I love that. I love that I didn't get toothpaste and I still got amazing deals and things that I could use like pens and back to school items. Um, a little treat for myself. 
a new lip gloss to try. And I got razors from Walgreens and I haven't gotten razors from Walgreens in quite a while. So I'm gonna show you my receipts for the drinks that I got um, because I did purchase them. I used those Walgreens store coupon register rewards to pay. I got some vitamin waters on this one. I used a five dollar register reward. My subtotal was one dollar. Used a, Wal a dollar in Walgreens cash and just paid three cents out of pocket. And then my second one, I got those Perrier's. My total was $2 before tax. And then I used $2 on Walgreens cash to pay and paid 14 cents out of pocket. So that's how I chose to use my store coupons. You can use them however you want. And I hope this video helps you out this week at Walgreens if you don't want to get toothpaste. Um, as always guys, like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Talk to you later, bye.